Welcome back to Legacy of the Void. So, Phoenix, or Clone Phoenix, whatever. You and I have stood shoulder to shoulder, blades thrumming in the heat of battle countless times. And now, you lead the Protoss. I well with pride at the mere thought of it. I was chosen to represent the Hierarchy by the remaining Judicators and the clans of the Nerezim. I am still honored by their choice. Tassadar must be proud as well. Tassadar is gone, Phoenix. He fell, bravely sacrificing for his people. He saved us from annihilation. What? It... it cannot be. And... I... fallen to the Zerg as well? It has. How long have I lingered in stasis, becoming this... Dragoon? Do you know of the Purifier program, Phoenix? Of course. The greatest Templar minds replicated. Dangerous machines that had to be shut down. They were shut down, but we have never ceased the research, and still have tried to find ways to replicate our greatest Templar to use that ancient technology. Why do you tell me this? I... I... We are facing a war like none we have seen before. We will need you in the days ahead. Maybe even the purifiers. Then my blades are yours, old friend. These new purifier designs rival any technology our people have previously conceived. The replication data is the sort that allows accurate duplication of one's consciousness. Phoenix's personality may be accurate. How accurate? Within the 99th percentile. So there is a chance for discrepancy. Quite a minuscule one. And in a lifetime, how many choices does that variation impact? Who would you be with such a difference in the decisions you've made? Keep a watchful eye on Phoenix. If he is to help us, I want to know who he is. That is useful, perhaps even more so than the ability to do this, but it would come at the cost. So I'm just gonna put in supply until I get more solarite. By the way, I did gain more solarite, I found the one. It was actually near the last corridor, so to speak, um, next to the facility, anyway. Ah, uh, Phoenix. We have acquired new robotic support technology for review. This gives speed and it can become a... it's a warp prism! <laughs> Great! Then there's this. I guess it depends on what you're gonna face to be honest, cause... You know, if you're gonna face a lot of Zerg then perhaps, you know, this is not necessarily the best idea, but... Um, if you're gonna go with this, yeah, depends on the mission, as I said. I think I'm gonna stick with the Annihilator and gonna switch to the Stalker. I don't know what's coming. Carax has utilized data from Glacius to bring the robotic sentinels online. Use them wisely, Hierarch. The enemy shall be purified. So we, the, the Protoss have become the robots, I guess. That's what they're gonna switch to, right?
Seeing Phoenix once more perplexes me. I feel sadness, but I should feel joy. It is said the warrior Phoenix was felled by the Queen of Glades. This approximation is not Phoenix, but he is a reminder of the loss you suffered. His voice, thoughts, his very presence. He describes memories we shared with such vivid recollection. Every instinct I have tells me that this is my friend, but all logic defies it. We of the Nerezim often ponder whether our people are the sum total of their experiences, or are more than them. A truth lingering inside us. In time, we shall see if this phoenix has his own truth, or is little more than a flawed forgery. I see the master construction of the Zelnaga now. Their understanding that energy, essence, and information are all one. Each interchangeable, each mutable. Then you uncovered the information Zeratul foresaw within this keystone. I have. From what I understand, it will lead us to Ulnar. Ulnar. It is a place of myth. A realm whispered of in our legends. The homeworld of the Selnaga. I believe the Keystone can project its location. Show me, Karax. survive within such unrelenting forces. It appears I have failed you, Hierarch. I do not believe so, Karax. It is said that the Zelnaga came from a place where no life should be. This aligns with Zeratul's prophecies. We will go in. Make preparations at once. Zeratul, many thought you mad. And yet, once more, you have seen truer than us all. The Keystone leads us into the Altarian Rift, to the Zelnaga home of Ulnar. It is my destiny to carry your mantle, old friend. I will wake the Zelnaga and honor your legacy. told me many stories of the Zelnaga. How Zeratul foresaw the Keystone would lead us here is uncanny. It is now clear that it was this device's primary purpose. Zeratul was in touch with an expression of reality beyond my understanding. This place should not exist. It defies all decrees of science, shatters all understanding of astral mechanics. I once thought we Protoss had reached the pinnacle of attainable knowledge. I was a fool. There is far more in the galaxy than exists within Protoss understanding, friend Karax. I know this now. 
Phoenix, you appear distressed. Apologies, Hierarch. I have been pondering the events that brought me here. I have discovered there are holes in my memory. Battles recorded here in the ship's archives that I should be able to recall, but cannot. What is it you have found? Records of my defeat at Antioch and being revived as a dragoon. But this body... It is clear to me that I am no dragoon. There is more to those records, Phoenix. But what you uncover may not be desirable. I am willing to face the truth, old friend, however difficult it may be. Then I hope you find the answers you seek. I welcome you, Hierarch. Not sure if this is even a good idea, but hey. It is hard to believe we stand above Ulnar, the home of the Ihan Ri, the Zelnaga. The Judicators theorized the Zelnaga left Ire to return to a place such as this. It is said they slumbered through the ages. Zeratul believed the artifact would lead us unto hope. The Zelnaga may be the hope he spoke of. If the legends are true, then the Zelnaga are below, awaiting their children to awaken them. Then let us hope so. Hierarch, it appears we cannot receive transmissions while we are within the rift. We have been cut off. The Keystone revealed this place to us. Perhaps Zeratul knew something of value after all. Zeratul believed. And so will I. The Spear of Adun's sensors have located what appears to be an access way into the temple. Our starships are prepared to move on your command. Taking control of the Celestial Lock is not the problem, holding it is. Titanic War Prism in less than 10 minutes? Not sure what the hell that is, but we'll see. Anyway. Quasine here on Serious Gaming. Sign out. Things get complicated and more and more complicated. This is where the Zenlaga were from? What the hell were these beings, anyway? <laughs> 